volleyball. Volleyball is a sport consisting of two teams of two, four, or six players where they compete over a net by trying to force the ball down on the opposition court under a set of rules. One team is allowed only three touches of the ball before it must be returned over the net. Volleyball is very popular in the world because it can be played anywhere like in a gym, on grass, and on a beach. There are many benefits of playing volleyball which can improve our flexibility, balance, and coordination. The ball is usually played with the hands or arms, but players can legally strike or push the ball with any part of the body. A number of consistent techniques have evolved in volleyball including spiking and blocking, as well as passing and setting. History of volleyball, a famous game in the world, started when William G. Morgan invented a game called Mintonet in 1895. This game was designed to have less contact and physical requirements. Mintonet was presented to the physical education directors in 1896 and they changed the name to volleyball because of the nature of the game when the ball was being volleyed from one side of the net to the other. The Federation International de Volleyball was founded in 1947 and the first World Championships were held in 1949 for men and 1952 for women. Meanwhile, volleyball made its Olympic debut at the 1964 Tokyo Olympic Games. Measurement of Volleyball Court As you can see, this is a sketch of the indoor volleyball court. There are three lines in the middle of the court. The line that dividing the court into two, called as net or center line. The, the other two line, it's called a tag line. A tag line dividing between the front row and the back row. The length of the volleyball court are 18 meters, with a width of 9 meters. So. If the court is dividing into two, the length of each side will be 9 meters. For the net height, men and women will use a different height, where men is 2.3 meters, while women will use 2.24 meters. The free zones at a minimum of 3 meters are required around the entirety of the court with generous clearance up 5 meters on the side and 6.5 meters in the back. Now that we had seen what indoor volleyball is, now let's see what is the differences between beach volleyball and indoor volleyball. But before that, what is beach volleyball? Beach volleyball is volleyball that you play on sand. That's it. And now we see the differences. So the first differences between beach volleyball and indoor vo volleyball is the players. Okay, so for beach volleyball, you only require two players. While it's different for indoor volleyball, you need, un you need six players. For beach volleyball, there would be no rotation while for indoor volleyball there would be rotations of players the second difference beach volleyball the first team to reach two sets of 21 points wins the game while for indoor volleyball the first team to reach three sets of 25 points wins the game and the final difference is the court sizes. Now, beach volleyball, the court size is 16 times 8 meters, while for indoor volleyball, the size is 18 times 9 meters. Means the indoor volleyball has a larger court area compared to beach volleyball. So, that is all the differences of beach volleyball and indoor volleyball.